The Westchester PGA has our annual Match Play Championship uh, and our first competitive opportunity of the season. Uh, it's so great to be back to tournament golf, especially for an event that we were unable to complete last year. I want to start by thanking the Country Club of New Canaan for hosting the event, uh, especially the members for sharing your beautiful facility and golf course with us. Uh, thanks to Adam Reno, PGA Head Professional, uh, for hosting. Uh, also, General Manager Kevin LaLumiere uh, and Golf Course Superintendent Mike Rowe. Um, the golf course was in unbelievable condition. Uh, the greens were uh, firm and fast. Also, like to thank our Met PGA partners uh, who were involved with the event: Connecticut Business Systems, Remedy Plus, Signs by the Sea, and Kirk and Matts, who provided uh, the beautiful uh, Crystal Trophy to our champion. We had some great matches this week. Uh, coming off his runner-up performance at the PGA Professional Championship, Century's Frank Benzel needed 23 holes to defeat Metropolis head professional Craig Thomas. He went 19 holes with Greg Biscani of St. Andrews, followed by 21 holes against Siwanoi assistant Charlie Mizell, before falling to eventual champion Peter Ballow of Silvermine in their semifinal match. Westchester Hills assistant Ken St. Charles made an impressive run to the other semifinal, where he would come up short against another Siwanoi assistant, Tim Pitts, who advanced to the final against Ballow. Pitts grabbed an early lead in the final match, but Ballow capitalized on opportunities on the back nine and made a few timely birdies to swing the momentum and take the match. Ballow, the 2019 Met PGA champion, now adds a Westchester PGA title to his resume. The win also comes on the heels of qualifying for his first PGA championship and should add some positive momentum as he heads to Kiowa in just a few weeks. Congratulations to Peter Ballow, the 2021 Westchester PGA champion. Pete Ballow, Pete, first off, congratulations, great playing this week. Let's talk a little bit about the course, what you thought about the conditions uh, that the crew here at New Canaan set up for you guys this week. Thank you. Um, yeah, um, Mike Rowe did a phenomenal job at this golf course. Um, I mean, it was firm and fast, and with the rain that we've had, to keep it still in those conditions was absolutely remarkable. 100% um, I gotta give their hat off to them. I mean, those guys did a phenomenal job with everything. Um, and, you know, it was a good long week. A lot of golf, as you just said, long week, six rounds. Let's talk a little bit about what worked for you this week and what kind of got you uh, to the championship and then ultimately win it today. Um, yeah, definitely a long week with six matches and, and uh, five, four days. Um, my putting was well, we did really good um, for the most part through the first four rounds, five rounds. Today struggled a little bit early. Um, I drove the ball well, kept it in the fairway, which is a big plus. I mean, with the conditions of the course, I mean, it was definitely a perk to be in the fairway rather than the rough. And, uh, you know, I managed to just kind of eliminate, you know, essentially bogey. I mean, this week, par was a really good score this week and even sometimes bogey was, um, depending on the hole and what the what you and the opponent were doing. Uh, so I just seemed to just limit um, the amount of mistakes and keep it in, in the fairway and then try to just get on the green as best I could. Yeah, I mean, it was hard. Um, you know, Timmy started off awesome. I mean, I think he one putted the first eight or nine greens, um, you know, and I threw a couple bogeys in, which was gonna happen for both of us. Um, so he, you know, with, the way he was putting, he took that big lead, and you know, I just, you know, just told myself that you know anything can happen. I mean, you know, if I can make a couple birdies and a couple good bars, you know, you know maybe things will happen and a bogey will come out of them. And it seemed that you know he just he got a couple bad lies out there and a couple bad breaks. Um, but for the most part, I just played pretty solid on that back nine with uh, I think like one or two birdies and just all bars. Well, congratulations, great playing this week. Good luck down there to you, and we'll be uh, following you. Yeah. Thank you, and uh, thank you to Kevin Lalumiere uh, for also hosting us, the manager here, and um, a buddy of mine, Adam Raynow, the pro, who um, obviously did his due diligence to get that this tournament here, um, and hats off to the membership for allowing us to take their golf course for the last four days.